how to use reference images in mid-journey v4 quick and easy hi guys welcome back to the channel and for today's video i will show you how you can easily create images like this so these images are look like a digital artwork and you can do this using your own portrait images so i will show you how you can easily do this in just a few steps all you need to do is to have a mid journey and just enter the keywords that you want your reference image to transform to and also we have this one so as you can see this is the reference image that is used and this is now the mid journey result so by the way mid journey is a software that can help you to transform your simple image to a new original artwork so without further ado, let me show you. So first, I need to go to my Discord account because this is the only platform that you can connect your mid-journey. So over here, as you can see, we have this one. This is the reference image that I am using for the example that we have here that I will show you later on. So let me just go ahead and show you the first sample here. So here we have the Pixar cute baby. And here's the image. So here, as you can see, it's very cute. This is a Pixar character. And as you can see here, since I included the uh, keyword cute and it looks so cute and also a baby looking character. So let me just go ahead and go to the next one is that I transformed this reference image to the uh, manga anime. And here's the result. As you can see, it looks so nice. And then the last one is the Autoboot Futuristic. And now, guys, I will show you how you can easily transform your simple image to something like this. So first, you need to have your own image, of course. And then here, just click this plus icon down here. And then just click Upload a File. And then just add your own image. So for example, this one over here. And then just click Enter to send that one and then we have now the uh, reference image here that we will be using to transform this into a new artwork so let me just go ahead and click this and then just right click your mouse and then just click the copy image link and down here type in forward slash and then just type imagine and then just enter the tab button on your keyboard. And now we have this prompt over here. And we will just paste the link that we just copy over here. And then the next thing that you need to do is to add some space. And then type the keywords that you want this image to transform to. For example, here I will go ahead and enter the Pixar, comma, futuristic, comma, cute so you can add as many keywords as you like and then after that just type in double hyphen and then v space 4 and click enter from your keyboard and just wait for the result so here as you can see we are still waiting to mid journey to start the process so here let's just wait it's not yet finished we are now in 31 percent and now here's the result so here it's not that cute so let me just go ahead and create another one so so again type in forward slash imagine hit tab and then just paste here the image link enter the manga enemy and then double hyphen v space 4 and click enter and let's see the result all right and here's the final result so here, as you can see, our image looks so good and I'm loving this one. So I guess that's all for today's video and thank you so much for watching. 